gente! Vote for Tropico 6! Or else! Hello everyone, Ace here, and today we are back with my let's play of Tropico 6. So, the last mission, we actually tried to turn Tropico into a worker's paradise, and ended up, I think, accidentally destroying communism and the Soviet Union. So that was fun. Uh, so yeah, we'll be actually doing the fourth mission now, which is Chocolate Factory. So, let's get started, shall we? Did you know, Help First Preach Later is a work mode in the chapel that offers health care for your Tropicans in the colonial era. I actually did know that, and it is actually a very useful option as it is the only way for them to actually get health care in that era. Okay, we've already seen this little hint before, or this did you know before, so I'm not going to go through that again. Um, Alright, let's go ahead. This soothing cup of locally sourced cocoa reminds me of our sweetest days. Okay. I speak of Chokiko, history's greatest chocolate factory. Let me remind you of a time when lemonade seas lapped against gingerbread beaches, parrot cakes nested in bubblegum trees, and people wore tea sherbets and mazi pants all year round. It was a sugary paradise. All right, sounds interesting. As I recall, it all began with the Wizard Wonkmeister golden coupons. <laughs> yep, we are going with a Willy Wonka President chocolate factory. Transparent mission. attempt to counter declining sales. Wizard Wonkmeister is holding a competition to visit his factory. Have a grocery. Very time simple is enough. Precious, President, especially your time as you. All right, let's see. Yeah, all citizens vote. Militia, fair enough right now. Ecology, energy efficiency, good. Separation, we'll go with official separation right now. So everything looks good on that front. And we do need to set up a grocery. That we can actually make money off of, so that is a good thing to do. Not a whole lot of money, but some. Okay, so let's see what we have in terms of resources. We have gold there. We have tons of uranium there if I can just get to it um, not sure how though maybe through here or something but if I can get to it I'll have I'll be set for life on the uranium front oh yeah that's right we can build tunnels I almost forgot Alright, so, I like the idea of having tons of uranium. And let's see what else we have here. Some iron and some aluminum. More gold. Small batch, but a decent batch. Nickel, plenty of that. Tons of gold here. And more. Alright, so I think with our first plan is going to be to try to get a few... Uh, We can get at least three. I think we can, so we will go ahead and get three. That works. Three uranium mines should be plenty for right now. Now let's also get that gold mine, I believe that was here. Yep. Can we get two? Nope, well, maybe if I actually move it differently. Yeah, no, it does not look like it's going to be a reality. That's unfortunate. But I can at least get one gold mine going, and that's something. There we go. 
Now yeah, let's see what else we can. What do we have in terms of plantations? Da -da -da -da. Bananas good here. Pineapples good. Sugar not so much. Cocoa in yeah, not really. Not tobacco. Coffee could work over there, but I don't think I've got enough room to really make it work as well as I'd like to. No. Yeah. Uh, rubber. Rubber could actually work. Interesting. And what do we have? Banana and... We actually have a cocoa farm here. Go ahead and get that. Simple enough. Do I want another banana? Or do I want a banana farm? Pineapple farm? Nah. I'm going to go with rubber. Only because I know it's a pretty useful thing to have. Oh, we also have iron or uh, coconut harvester. That sounds good. We have a grocery, Presidente. Let's buy chocolate. Wear this realistic false nose, or you will be recognized from the picture on the money. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and buy some chocolate. And it's from the Dominican Republic, apparently. Interesting. I didn't know Willy Wonka put his chocolate factory all the way out there. Oh well. Yeah, I'm only gonna be able to... Ooh, I might be... Yep, I got two aluminum mines, so that is useful. Why do you... Fine. Studies show that the meat from happy animals tastes better than that from sad ones. <laughs> you can stick on a fancy label saying cruelty free and hike up the prices. Just have the ranch workers stop and pet the livestock. It's not the most efficient farming technique, but the hippies and flower people will be delighted. As much as they can be about meat farming. Fine, I'll do it. This bar. All right, so let's see what else we can do. Um, that works. Now, other stuff we can get. I could get some good coffee plantations working if I can just set them up right. I think that's going to be about as good as it gets there, so we'll set one here. The President Day announces a new Snitch for Cash program. Report something suspicious today, and you could win fabulous cash prizes. <laughs> well, I could get crocodiles, which is exactly what I'm going to do, because... That will get me quite a bit of resources. Well, there's a pretty good resource to get in this game. Um, I could get another rubber plantation, but I'm not sure that's a good idea. Uh, ooh, if I can get... Yeah, I think I could probably set up some decent tobacco plantations here. Okay, so my plan is I'm going to try to get a road between these without them affecting the plantation. Good. That works. Oh, right. Problem solved.
All right, so let's see what we've got to work with. Uh, so far we have logs, coconut, pineapple, wool, and banana. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. I have to set that up to max and do the same there because it raises the prices. This is a, the Conventio, ah, here we are. Oh yeah, we have to visit the grocery ah, now. Enemies all around. I shall defeat you all. Contact, comrade. Secure this communication. Okay, so we have to fill a trade deal with the Soviets. Simple enough. We'll export bananas, since I'm pretty sure we can do that. My grandpappy used to say, you can't make lemonade without a plantation and a good supply of migrant workers. <laughs> I think I'll go ahead and build a mausoleum, even though it's going to be extremely expensive and everything else. Um... Judgment is always impeccable. Build a couple of residential buildings, simple enough. It might be a good idea to get a few more tenements up. Get the arcade going. Why is nobody playing the arcade? Oh, you have to be well off, that's why. You put the earth first and now everyone is happy. Or they would be if they knew how important the planet was. We have the chocolate, Presidente. Now to open the first bar and find that golden coupon. No, maybe the second. No, but it must be here. <laughs> hey there, Presidente. Someone with a real strange nose bought all my store's chocolate. Of course, I have no idea who that person was. <laughs> Presidente, I have eaten 100 bars of chocolate and still you have no coupon. I have failed you. And I'm feeling very strange. <laughs> oh dear. Now, I know this actually island here is going to be really useful once I get my economy really going because that also happens to be where a lot of my cocoa production is going to have to come from later. Okay, so it looks like we're going to have some money coming in, but we need more. Simple enough. I need another Teamster's office, among other things. So we will go ahead and get one built. We will build it. Yeah, I think it's a good idea to build one here with all the uranium. Right, let's see if I can even... If that works. The number one sign of being a spy is voting against El Presidente in an election. Do not make this fatal mistake, citizen. Good to know. Alright, so once we get the building there built, it should be one step closer. Oh yeah, I need to research church fee. I know the military understands the importance of industry because we make their weapons. I think a fire station would be more beneficial right now. Wow, look at all the shacks. Um, yeah, I'm gonna build a tenement over here once I get the chance.
All right, so the tobacco is starting to come in. That's good. I'm going to need more, though. There we go. Something else showed up. I'm not sure what, but there we go. And we reached the pop limit that we needed to reach. That's done, and oh, here comes the money. See how many of these left I need. Eh, one. Simple enough. How expensive is that mausoleum going to be anyways? I, I don't typically get it... Um, well, I probably... Ouch. Probably should. I'm going to do public advertisements because that is going to help me make a little bit more money. I had the nightmare again, Presidente. No, not the penguins. The destruction of Tropico by falling bombs. Why do I need a nuclear program? Uh, well, at least I can... Okay, so I can do a few things now. Let's see, what else do we have available to us resources, right? We, because we need to get more stuff made. Okay, so we can get iron here, and quite a bit of it, I might add. So that's an option. Um... Trying to think of what I can really do to... Oh, well, factories for one thing. I do need... Okay, so I do have a couple of tobacco plantations. So it would be a wise idea to actually get myself a cigar factory going. Can set it up there. Let's see. Can I build a fisherman wharf? I can do that. Or I could try to build a dock. No, I don't have enough money. Uh... Always that problem. Oh well. Let's see, am I producing any research? No, I am not. So I'm going to have to build a library too. Let's try getting one of those. Let's see, here it is. Grocery set up here because I'm pretty sure we're going to need at least something along those lines. I know I, I could have sworn I saw one. Here we go, this works. And while we are at it, let's go ahead and build a dock. Looks like a good spot. Humbly teach you something. What use is power if you don't? Might do the tax cut edict once uh, an election starts rolling around. Might not be that long, so probably be a good idea. Okay, so let's see. What else can we do? Um. Okay, so maybe goats. Yeah, goats. That way I can produce milk, which will allow me to get a creamery going. Long building.
Ooh, we can now upgrade this thing proper. There we go. Or not, never mind. <laughs> I forget what aluminum's actually used for in this particular game. Um, let's see. Nope, nope. Nope, even that still uses, okay. So I guess, alum I forget what aluminum's used for, I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, let's see, but we can get, um, well, I'm pretty sure we got wool getting produced, so a textile mill might not be that bad of an idea. But, well, for now, the creamery will do. We need another factory. So we have two different work modes, but I'm not sure what the difference does, actually. What makes the Cold War so cold? The lack of love for El Presidente. Remember, loving El Presidente is your patriotic duty as a Tropican. I think the different work modes are just a joke or something. Okay, so we made a little money on that, but not a whole lot. Ouch. Even still we're in the red. But hey, at least the goat ranches are actually getting the cost reduction thing going. It's a good upgrade to have. Now, you would think that that would finish the trade route, but we've run into that little bug again, which is unfortunate. But we do have, let's see, I th if I can just find where the lumber mill is, I'll build a logging camp there. Well, not a logging camp, a... Sorry, well, sorry, I got those reversed. <laughs> but yeah, my plan is going to be to find where that thing is, and then... Llama Ranch. Interesting. Hmm. Here it is. Okay. So very simple, um, and it's been upgraded, so that means once I get another one of these up... There we go! Lumber mill away! Build that. And then... Do I build furniture or do I do a shipyard? I'm leaning towards furniture. Oh, we can actually also make furniture out of plastic. That's really interesting to know. Well, if I want to do that, I'm going to want to get the fracking posts. And also, I also want to get that as soon as possible, just in case to keep it from running out. A That's what I think. wrote in asking, how do I know if my neighbor is a spy? The palace responds, take no chances. Spy on everyone. Okay, so that is dealt with. And let's see. We can also make it out of plastics too, so... Yeah, we'll build a plastics plant 
Uh, somewhere near this. Nope, can't build it there. But I can build it here. Which is exactly what I will do. And while we are at it, we we're not, once I get my next thing, I'll finally go ahead and build that third grocery. Also need to build a Teamsters office. I I just noticed, because yeah, no worries. We'll build it right there, and also that grocery because I do need that too, just to progress the rest of the mission. I'll place it here. Looks good. Our money's at work, Prez. I up. Need some help, Presidente? If you want that golden coupon, you'll need as many Wonkmeister bars as you can get your hands on. Presidente, thank you. Your great popularity with the people gained you a golden coupon. And you named me your plus one. Lemonade seas, bubblegum trees, marzipants? Oh, I declare this to be gibberish, Presidente, and far from a viable business model. <laughs> okay, so we're going to start our little ticket to the chocolate factory business. Simple enough. First, I'm going to need more money, though, so that's a good thing. I'm starting to get an industry built. Yep, here we go. Alright, so we can go ahead and I believe th they actually gave us two free plantations. And the great news about that is we have some excellent areas to work with to get some good cocoa produced. So, two cocoa plantations and a chocolate factory coming right up. We're at it. We'll also get a Teamsters office built because this is going to be a little bit of a. Also, we'll set it to dark luck chocolate. And I cannot build a new dock yet, or else I would and start just sending stuff through that. Also, we'll upgrade the Teamsters port. The Something. citizens are demanding elections, Presidente. It seems that they want them. No, but now is actually a good time once I have the money to actually issue that tax credit or that tax cut I've been planning. Wow, look at the money just start rolling out there. Who is winning the Cold War? A special report for. Want to get on everyone's good side? slash taxes and worry about balancing the budget after the next election. Always a pleasure doing business with you, Presidente. All right, there we go. And now we'll build a new dock. Connect the road to it. There we go. And let's add in another couple of cocoa plantations. I was gonna add in another one, but. Now let's see, what is going to be my next part of this little strategy of mine? We need to get some gold going. So what I think I'm gonna do is get another dock built this time over here. And we'll, yep. 
First, let's make sure where the gold actually is. Okay, so there's some there, some here. And if we build a tunnel, we can actually get more here. Although I probably will just want to build two more docks. I don't know. Anyways, so the plan is we'll go ahead, build a dock here at least. Done. Getting as many gold mines as possible is going to net me so much money. Okay, we have four more there. Oh, why isn't it working? Okay. Let's try this way. Well, I can at least get another one there built. So that's three gold mines. And done. I don't typically build this, these many docks, so this is going to be a bit of an experiment for both of us. Or for all of us, I should say. But hey, it should help logistically speaking when it comes to getting all the gold here brought up. Having those at least is paying off. Okay, so let's go ahead and also get a tunnel connector set up. Although, I'm not sure just how useful it is. Actually, let's see. Where is the other gold at? Here. And it is a good size amount, too. I think I could at least get two, maybe three. We'll find out if three is valid. Oh yeah, okay. So we'll go ahead and, hmm. Yeah, we'll, I guess we can build another dock just for the heck of it. And done. But just for the heck of it, tunnel connection. Just to connect these a little bit more, just in case. I don't know why. We'll find a use for it, I'm sure. Actually, let's see if there's any oil. No. Let's see if there's any oil on this island. Oh, wait, what? Nickel, huh? That could be useful. Okay. I'm sure the good citizens of Tropico intend to vote. Yeah, we're going to be fine, I think. The water may be cold, but the weather is going to be hot, hot, hot. Stay tuned for Canal Uno's meteorological report. Hoy hace caliente. So more cocoa, and I think we'll build one here. Yep, and another one here. It gives us quite a few, actually. So now we'll build another chocolate factory. So it's the same work mode as the other one. 
And we're at, while we're at it, we'll go ahead and set up one more. And they'll both be set to dark Election shot. is a landslide, Presidente. The metaphorical kind, not the kind that accidentally reduces the size of the workforce. <laughs> okay, simple enough. We'll keep things as they are. And rely exclusively on dark chocolate. According to El Presidente, this was the single greatest and most unforgettable political victory in Tropico's history. <laughs> but we are sure the palace is just being modest. Okay, so we have okay. In Ultimo so opened your factory today, Presidente. He used chocolate scissors to cut a red licorice ribbon. It took three hours. <laughs> Presidente, we're in the chocolate business. Now to give Wonkmeister the competition of a lifetime. All right. I actually forgot about these missions. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. Oh, well. Another Teamster's office built. And let's see about... Oh, we need more power. Well, it's a good thing I happen to have some... Also, we might as well get some more mines built. You know what? We'll just hold off on that for now. Okay, so that's going to give us a lot of money. This one, not so much because... Eh. I need another Teamster's office around here big time. Okay. Actually, I need two Teamster's offices. That's how big this job is going to be. Actually, I, that won't help any. I don't have enough guys, apparently, for it. Oh, well. There we go. I think I could get at least two of these. And connected. And that's all done. Don't you just love watching the boats? See, I do have a plastic factory, correct? Yep. Oh yeah, I need an I need this thing built and ready to go soon. Well at least that's gonna be producing me money. I got the gold there coming in, although not a whole lot yet. This one's gonna be help me a bit. Okay, now we have enough for a nuclear power plant. We'll give it high priority because that is exactly what it is. Oh no, that's not good. I need to build a fire station right now. <laughs> Good thing I can. I'd like to think that we're friends, President Dave. I think I know what's going on. Another day, another deal completed. Very nice. If I do say so myself. I ask, I don't have an. Wait, I don't know what's going on. I mean.
All right, that's good. Now, oh, I still need the nuclear pro program, the mausoleum. Whoops. Don't you just love watching the boats leave? I think I can do that. So while we are at it, by the way, let's go ahead and get that mausoleum finally built. <laughs> Sorry. Like I said, I really don't usually decide to get it. It's but since they, for whatever reason, the communists really, really want it. I don't know House why. House announces today a new tax scheme allowing citizens to pay extra for preferential treatment during routine search and seizure actions. Sign up today! Okay, that is pretty funny. <laughs> there. Now our electricity problems will forever be a thing of the past. Let's see. Maybe I could build cars out of with aluminum too. Maybe that's something that you do with the aluminum. I'm not sure. It is a great day for our comrades. Okay, well, let's go ahead and what else do we need? We need a nuclear program, apparently. Well, if we're going to do that, we might as well get a spy academy first. And there is a method to my madness here, because we can net, because once that's done, we'll be able to raid and get a whole lot of uh, into, uh, knowledge points, which is what we need to do that. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's gonna be a bit expensive, so I might as well hold off a little while. So apparently my strategy of getting a whole bunch of docks is actually paying off. President Day focus groups tell us that people don't want thousand year old chocolate. I fired my marketing department. Again. <laughs> <laughs> we refocused the focus groups, President Day. We need to, and I quote, Move out of Squaresville and get hip to be it, Daddy-o. Now that the war is over, Presidente, we finally have a chance to demonstrate your unlimited greatness to the world. I am so excited. Ah, I mean... A powerful gesture for a powerful leader. This is not simply a spark of genius. It is atomic. Yep, and what's more, I'm going to need to use the raid points to get a whole bunch of knowledge for it. I think that should be enough. Anyways, the method to my madness is gonna be like such. Get this built. It'll appease the military faction anyways, which is what I'm trying to do. so fast that humans couldn't handle it. What a relief. Alright, let's get that. That'll help that. And you know what? If the pineapple production is... No, it's not. But I could put it here. And 78% isn't great, but considering 
these will increase the efficiency of it. Ooh, there we go. The best defense is a good offense. And we are now in nuclear power. Well, kinda. Need around 5,000 knowledge, which, how much do we have? Not a whole lot. Basically, we, well, we need to re, well, we're going to get a research lab to speed it up a little. simple. Now to increase the happiness of everyone a bit and at the same time make a little bit of money. Tenements away! Okay so we pretty much gave everyone here a house. See what else we can do. Entertainment wise, da, 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 da. movie theater. We can buy one of those. And that should be. Yeah, having a whole bunch of docks is really paying off. I might just have to do that more often as a strategy. Alright, so the money's gonna start rolling in pretty good. We're at it. You might want to get another tenement or two built here. That's one set done. Bang. Okay, we only needed one apparently. Actually, let's try demolishing a few of these and see if they move in. Yep, they did. Presidente, I am inspired. I have solved the problem of capitalism. Have Ministry of Information. Okay, let's see. Uh, also, while we are at it, where public services garbage dump. Apparently we need another logging camp, so we'll go ahead and build another one. Okay, so we have... We're getting close. We're actually getting close to 4,000 knowledge, which is not too far from where we need to be to actually research that. And it will also mean that we will never be under the threat of an invasion ever again, I believe. So that is really good news. Let's see. Migration office, no. Ministry of Information, there we go. The palace today announces a new mascot. Hermano Mayor. He is big and he's your brother. He'll always keep an eye on you. It is a great day for our comrades. We even had cake to celebrate. <laughs> okay. So 
see, what else can we do? Fun fair pier, eh. Restaurant, those tend to actually usually generate a decent amount of money. Yep. And while we are at it, I do believe we should probably start building hospitals. I know it sounds horrible. I'm only now building the things, but eh. There we go. we can now build the bomb. Alright, ooh. We'll go ahead and increase the efficiency, because why not? Set your alarm, Presidente, because Ecoparel never sleeps. The seas are poisoned and the sky's full of holes. Woohoo! How about no? Once we get into the next year, we'll be able to build a coliseum, and that will just, or stadium, sorry, and that will just make so much money. Oh well, let's see. I actually forgot to actually upgrade that, and this one too. Simple. Remember, war is peace. Freedom is slavery. Ignorance is strength. Coffee is pineapple juice, and Tropico is the future. Stay tuned to Canal Uno. Okay. The citizens are demanding elections, Presidente. It seems that they want a choice in... I will go ahead and simply Want issue a tax everyone. cut. <laughs> now let's see we do have some points to spare so employee of the month church fee transport services like normal we'll get this too I'm tempted to actually take this again if only because of just how uh, amazingly hilarious it was to have religious figures going around arresting people um, good old days. Let's see. Uh, it does increase tourism rating. And... Yeah, okay. It... Well, this one's useful, so I will take that. And I think that's pretty good. Ah, President Now, the fire station, sure. Especially around here. Oh, and that reminds me, I should probably go ahead and start upgrading the mines too. I'd like to think. Thirty thousand, sure. Okay, 
Okay, so apparently these are out. Yep. <laughs> oh, you have to be kidding. Finally, the power to bring the world to an end is at your fingertips, as it always should have been. <laughs> the Cold War is over. The future is now present, and the present will presently pass into the past. Okay. Yeah, we'll just do privacy rights. Yeah, this sounds like... Fair, fine. We'll just do the default state. The modern world has no time for morality, Prez, so we... Okay. Wonkmeister... Wonkmeister... Ah, yes. Logistical problems, Presidente. Look, Wonkmeister has filled this form in with a blue pen. <laughs> the wind blows, Presidente. Some build walls, while others build windmills. And some build chocolate factories. Presidente, you are alone? Nobody is listening. We must talk chocolate with special ingredients. <laughs> hey there, pal. I hear you want to compete with Wonkmeister. Fine by me, but he's not your only competition. Americans thrive on competition. Okay, if I'm going to get the right to arms, and I do already have that, that is a very simple edict for me to pass. You're never really free. Let's, while we're at it, we'll go ahead and get the others done, too. And done. And while we're at it, we'll go ahead and raise those church fees up. As the Iron Curtain becomes scrap metal, El Presidente says, how much for that? <laughs> okay, so let's see what else we can do here. Um... We need to build a few embassies. Simple enough. I can build them pretty much around here, I think, and they'll make me... They'll fill it out easily enough. Oh, there we go. I'm pretty sure with China, all I have to do is actually... Okay, we'll invite the EU to embassy... Job happiness has to be higher. Okay, fair enough. And the U.S. We'll level up the arms right thing. And China, trade route. Simple enough. Let's see, what do we have to offer China? Cheese. Very simple contract. We will sign it. Now let's see. How do we... Okay, well, liberty, pretty good. Crime safety, eh. Beauty. Let's go ahead and increase the beauty of these areas. Because that tends to increase the standing that these nations have with you. Now, job happiness. Uh, what is an effective way to increase that? Well, we could just increase all the wages, which is what I believe I did the last mission. Yep. Why did I not have that upgraded in the first place? My okay. grandpappy used to say, you can't make lemonade without a plantation. Modernize a mine, simple enough. Let's see. We'll need a lot of money to modernize everything, but I think we can I do have it. something I would like you to do for me. <laughs> did that sound like a choice? I suppose I must have misspoken. <laughs> I sometimes wonder, President, what the world would be like without me. Static, still, unmoving, as if the wind were gone. All right, we might as well get in a uh, trade deal with Russia signed too, because why not? Simple enough. Okay, we do have tons of uranium, so once we finally get the resources we need. 
sure the good citizens of Tropico intend to vote. Yeah, I'm pretty confident about that too. Ooh, we now have enough to modernize all the mines. Oh yeah, we have to research it. Eh, so let me... There. We yeah, now have all enough to re to modernize all the mines. Um, why didn't it work? I'd never count my chicken feet. That was a close one, but so far so good. Yeah, that was a pretty nasty bug, I think. I have here an official statement from the palace saying, "Don't mention how close the election was." Uh. Yes! Our neighbor's election was extremely close! Do you know why our Great Wall became so long? A collision of insane ambition and extremely cheap labor. <laughs> okay, well, actually we already have... Oh, well, we might as well get a second one. I'm pretty sure we have coffee, so we'll go ahead and buy that, too. Can I upgrade? Yep. So, oh yeah, there's these mines up here. Oh, they're already dealt with. Can we talk about the issues, President Day? Certainly people are concerned about the issues. It's past time someone did something. There we go. Oh yeah, I need to improve my nickel mines too. Ah oh, well. Okay, that's a very simple one to accomplish, so we'll go ahead and do that. So you waste trait facility. Da -da -da. And now every there. You know, pal, you're my kind of world lead. And we'll export to the US. Simple enough. Ooh, we need more electricity. Problem solved. Let's see what else we can do job quality wise. Mandatory CS say that's an easy one to get done, so why not? So, you know that math is the secret language of the universe, and algebra is the graffiti of reality. Uh, why not? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's also go ahead and make sure the other one is filled. What is it? You know, I'm not even sure what it was now. I've got so many of these things open. Oh, here we go. National Edict Day, sure, or National Day. Okay, simple enough. You 
know what helps keep the people from thinking about their troubles? Oh, Presidente, your political maneuverings are others. Yep, that's one the fulfilled. The statement from the palace declares cryptocurrency to be unpatriotic. If it doesn't have a picture of El Presidente on it, it's not currency. Just for the sake of it, we'll also invite these guys in. Let's see. Praise them, and oh, also, I believe I have a... International. There we go. Presidente, my friend, you catch me on a good day. The burden of my wealth feels light, like a fluffy marshmallow. Sure, we'll sell chocolate to you. Just need to get that happiness thing high enough. Actually, wait a sec. I have an alternative way of dealing with this power problem. I will build a power plant. A solar power plant. Once I have the money for it. This paperwork is exquisite, Presidente. All 430 sub clauses are passed on your first submission. It's unheard of. <laughs> okay, let's. Go. Ooh, we got that one filled too. And we will get this one filled, and I think that should win us the mission. The China trade route thing, I don't think is quite working for us, but a, not really a necessary thing. Yeah, this ex all these extra docks are really paying off. Thanks for your help, Presidente. Remember, listening to me is always the right thing to do. Your genius is undeniable, Presidente, but would you? Eh, fair enough, and I have a way of dealing with that. We'll go ahead and just build ourselves a high school. Also, oop, also a college because I can definitely afford it. I think that's mission complete. Chocico chocolate is a sensation, Presidente. Wonkmeister's Dream Factory has been downsized, and its employees are out on the street. <laughs> oh dear, we took we actually kicked Willy Wonka out of the chocolate factory business. <laughs> My memory is uncertain. Did little people dance and sing? Or did we take a boat ride upon a river of confusion? <laughs> I know for sure that we ran a purveyor of ethically made, high quality confectionery out of business and substituted cheap candy drenched in corn syrup marketed via a host of dirty tricks for profit. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Seas of lemonade, beaches of gingerbread. Presidente, it was much, much better than that. You have done it, Presidente. Victory is ours. I mean, victory is yours. Okay. So this has been Ace. I hope to see you guys again soon. Take care. Ace out.